Hey, this is Swagger's doing Lollipop Chainsaw. And this is a double little achievement guide here for the Stage 2 boss, Vike. Um, or Vicky. Who knows? The two achievements are Cheerleader Overboard, which is to succeed in the quick time event at the edge of Vike's ship, and that's going to be in the second part of the video, the middle kind of part, second stage of the fight. And then just the overall Viking metal rules, uh, which is to defeat him. Let's cut this bit into bite-sized chumps. I'm gonna use her face to make a hat and use her spine as a back scratch. That one might work. Fight the back scratcher thing might work. I don't know. Make a make a face. Make a hat out of the face. It's gonna have holes. It's not gonna keep the sun out. It's not gonna keep the rain out. <laughs> Okay, first stage is just a straightforward attack phase. Um, you can only do damage to him in the rear. You can also use your blaster. He's also bigger than you, so it can be hard to dodge around him. Um, so just note that. Um, you can also use your blaster for some damage. And it's gonna reappear at the back of the ship. What the fuck's with the pet bear? What sucks about this boss is if you get down, it's very easy for him to juggle you a couple hits um, before you're able to dodge away because of your beat. Depending on how fast your recovery is. See, I'm already hit again before I can even get back up. And then I'm get the lightning and then I get dodged and it's just it sucks. When he's up there you you just start uh going for the blaster. And he's just gonna send kind of basic lightning bolts. Now these guys I was trying to take them out, but that's not really what you're supposed to do. They're just gonna come shooting down at you and you just have to dodge them. Like that. Just dodge out of their way. While still uh firing up at him, which I'm not doing, but I should be doing. And wait for it to actually come up. You're supposed to be doing it while you're doing these dodges. Shoot him! Shoot the, blast the glass. <laughs> and then he'll come back down and you can start beating on him. Oh, I totally dodged up the way that. Lollipop time! with the pet bear. That was the first stage of these bosses, the hardest. There's not really a trick. I mean, there's tricks to them, obviously, but... Seems like the second and third stages of these guys are all just kind of like fancy tricks. <sighs> all the time with the lightning. I think half the video is just trying to get them down. Cut them off. Lightning has always freaked me out. <laughs> Not even like in front of him there. He almost got the triple feet on him. Hit him! Ha ha ha! 
Do to do do do. There we go. Okay. Oh, you got a lot of gall, little girl. Now we're on to stage two. This is where we're going to get our secondary achievement, Cheerleader Overboard. And um, obviously, you don't want to take out the bottom half. You need the bottom half. And you need to survive just and survive and dodge just a little bit. You can do some damage to the top if you want. Um, but you need to survive just a little bit until he's going to go back up to his drums again. You can do it in this first section. I don't know. It just seems easier. It seems like almost automatic in the next. Not the whole section, but the next half of this stage, too. Okay, so he's going to go back up there. And he's going to start sending, this time he's going to send out shockwaves. And this right side that I'm looking at there, the right side of the, the ship is where you're going to want to be. I'm too close to him to see where the shockwaves are. Camera angles can be pretty horrible. So it doesn't really take much to get him back down. Okay, so now that you're down, you want to be on this right half. And you need to dodge his front, his top half, and you need his bottom half to come running at you while you're on this side. Which he's going to do right here. And he's going to kick you and you're going to go overboard, and then you're going to into a, a quick button smash for B as he's trying to stomp your hand off, and you're trying to just change some of the face. And what's nice is that doing that also instantly gets rid of the bottom half of him, and you'll get the, the achievement right away, which is always nice. And then we just gotta take off the top half here. To be fairly quick. <laughs> right before he probably would have wiped me out there. Hey, stupid bottom half, what are you doing back? He's like a worm, there's two of them. Bottom half. Worthless. Uh oh, not a lot of time. Spent a lot of time kind of messing around with this one because I didn't know where that quick time was going to happen. Boom, the head's off. Okay, so now he's just a big giant head. And this is just a blaster dodge section. He takes damage pretty good, pretty quick here. It just seems you need to dodge the initial blast there. I've, I've never been hit by the actual <laughs> So we'll do these laser beams. And then he's gonna just uh, jump around like a pinball at the bottom. Finish him. Finish him. 
I love when they give you the finish, but you like you can't get to it. And there you go. And this is going to be en the end of this and little cutscene, and the achievement will pop. And there you go. Another boss eliminated. Another stage complete. This bites my non-existent balls. <laughs> <laughs> 